Right now, four law enforcement officials on administrative leave after a wild police chase ended today in the backyard of a church, a KCK church. Police fired multiple shots and killed the armed suspect on the church grounds. Jadion Thompson has been there since the story broke early this morning and joins us there live now. Jadion, you spoke with the pastor? Yes, we did, Justin, and ironically, he tells me that they have an outreach program for people who have a criminal past, and he is just sad that someone died here on the church grounds today. Now, this is as close to the scene as we've gotten to, to get all day long. You can see right there where that truck sat most of the day and that playground he crashed into just really destroyed at this time. This is a much different scene than it was earlier today. Police tell us the suspect bailed out of a stolen Dodge Caravan in Bonner Springs when he carjacked a Moxie pest control pickup truck from the technician at gunpoint. An Edwardsville police officer tried to get the suspect to pull over, and when he didn't, that chase started on K-32. It went into Kansas City, Missouri for a short time on 670. Police tell us the driver tried to hit a patrol car in this process, and you can see the suspect really driving almost like he's out there four-wheeling. Stop sticks were put down, flattened those tires shortly before the driver crashed here in KCK at this church. Multiple shots were fired then, killing that suspect in the backyard of the church. The pastor tells me he's sad for the loss of life. Most of our members are people who come from backgrounds of um, criminal backgrounds, drug-related backgrounds, and because uh, we do a lot of drug rehab in those kind of areas, and so uh, that's what our main ministry is. In fact, it was started by an ex-heroin addict. Now, the driver of that pest control vehicle is okay at this hour, according to that company, Moxie. The suspect's name has not been released yet. I just talked with police, and they tell me that's because all of next of kin have not been identified or notified, that is, just yet. And as for the police officers, four of them on uh, routine administrative leave. Justin is routine in a situation like this. There is one Kansas Highway Patrol officer and three Kansas City, Missouri police officers who are on leave tonight for firing those shots. Live in KCK, Jadion Thompson, 41 Action News. All right, thank you, Jadion. Police began that chase at K-32 and I-435. The pursuit, pursuit continued on K-32, eventually merging onto Caw Drive. In KCK, the chase went from Park Drive onto Central Avenue. KC Missouri Police joined the pursuit on 670. The suspect exited onto I-35, then onto Southwest Boulevard. Police followed the suspect until he crashed off of 12th Street and Ruby Avenue.